pretty tight, so it'll kind of, you'll know when it hits the bottom. And then don't hit the peckers. Does the peckers mean? Like that, did, 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 did. you just want lunge, lunge, and then reel down, hit him. Hit, hit him hard. Well, it's just a little, unless you have. Oh no, he just woke up. <laughs> he definitely woke up. You can take your time on him. Nice. Look at you go, Dal. Oh, it's been a little while. Hasn't it? It's been a long time. <laughs> no, slow down a bit. Oh, he's a nanny. Is that? Yeah. You wouldn't let me down like that. I wouldn't. All right, so slowly walk back. That's a big old nanny. Oh, Dal, you've done it. Oh, wow. You've definitely done it. <laughs> Let's um, take him up the front. It's a really good start. That's a great start, honey. <laughs> That's a good fish. All right. Nicely done. done. This is a little, little baby fish, but I'm taking it because my idea might work. What's your idea? Oh, I'm just going to use like micro jigs and then see. <laughs> oh, get out of it. This is your big first bait video, babe. Massive shark. See him down there, Snail? Oh, poor little cod. He's dead. He's dead now. Oh, babe. <laughs> so much face. Gonna try and flick him in. Oh, what on earth are you doing here? That's cool. That's amazing. Wow. Wow, you did well to miss that shark. Coming in hot. Yeah, don't come up here with it. Okay, I've been here for three years. And that is the first little jelly belly yellow fin. Just burning up a 40 gram jig and he's eating it on the way up. Such a cool little fish. That thing is going to be so delicious. I'm going to bleed him quickly and prep him for sashimi. Well, it honestly doesn't get much calmer than this. I'm out with Jess and Tennille. Um, if you don't know Tennille or Drew, the guy I went fishing with the other day, got that nice finger. That's his partner. <laughs> Very lucky girl, because he is up. He's not bad. Um, we came out today chasing nannies, and 
oh my have we found them like probably the biggest show of nannies i've ever seen and it's like it's not just deep it's long it's like a hundred meter stretch of nannies but i'm not sure if it's because there's so many nannies there's so many sharks like i honestly can't i'll play a bit of footage after this just to show you the frustration but i'll show you how to do it i'll show you how to get them away from sharks it may not be the most uh elegant way to do it but we're getting out of here with a couple of nannies in the esky because the freeze is looking pretty empty Alright, so you can see here that is the nanny school that we're coming into. Uh, that particular school is 10 metres deep. So the idea is we know the sharks are there. You would have seen on the footage how quickly these sharks are taking fish and there's only so much I can deal with that so I'm going to hook up and Jess is going to do the bees nest and get ready to go Go, 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 go. That's how you extract a nanny from sharks. <laughs> All right, neutral. That is a proper good nanny. Um, it's how you extract them too from sharks. There's only one way to do it. You can't beat that, like the shark that just came up after him was a proper six footer. Like you just, you're never gonna beat him. So, we're definitely going to catch a few and we're just going to have to extract them. I'll show you how it's done. Is that time to shine, babes? Yeah. This is it. One shot. One opportunity. We're either going to be mum's spaghetti <laughs> or we're going to be nanny tacos. <laughs> So Many it's up to your, it's not up to me, it's up to your driving. <laughs> yeah, literally. We have eight metres of nannies down there. Oh, you.
No mum spaghetti here. We might have to do that again. <laughs> anyway. Definitely not mum's spaghetti tonight. <laughs> <laughs>